What's up guys? It's your man Dominic D. Hargrove here, Slight Edge Performance Program. As you can see, the sun is setting here, beautiful South Beach, Miami. Out here, Muscle Beach, South Beach. You already know what it is, but I was inspired through my inner man uh, to give you this video. This video is three keys to getting your prayers answered because you want to be confident when it comes to getting your prayers answered. You want to be confident when it comes to talking to God. You want to be confident when it comes to manifesting your destiny, manifesting your reality like the power that has been given to you to do. So I want to give you this video, three keys to getting your prayers answered. The first key, it comes from one of my favorite scriptures is Mark 11, 24. And the scripture says, whatsoever things you desire when you pray believe you receive them and you shall have them whatsoever things you desire you want you need when you pray when you meditate when you ask when you knock when you seek believe you already have them and you should have them okay so that's my first tip now don't take my word for it. Go do your research for yourself. Find this scripture for yourself, okay? The second key is that word believe, okay? Believe. To believe. What does it really mean to believe? I got a revelation for you. Believe. All right, now take that B and then put a dash and you got leave. Believe. So say you want to lose 30 pounds, right? So right now you are a certain state of mind in a certain state that you want to change. One day passes, three day passes, next thing you know, 30 days pass and you're consistent with working out, exercise, eating lifestyle. You be one person, you leave and you become the new person. You get what I'm saying? The, the, the caterpillar cocoon butterfly effect. Be leaving, going on a journey. Once you uh, decide what you want and you decide to believe for it, it's going to take some action. It's going to take some steps. It's going to take some process of time. You're going to be one way and through a process of time, you're going to become someone new. If any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. So the, in the third step, so that's one, two, the third step comes from Mark chapter 12, verse 30. Very important. It says, uh, uh, what is it? it says, love the Lord thy God with all your heart, mind, soul, strength. Remember, Moses was like, who should I say sent me? They're not going to believe me. Who should I say sent me? And what did God say? He said, I am that I am and that is my name forever think about it you've been saying I am since you were conscious of your I am you was like I am in the third grade then you said I am seven then you said I am in high school then you said I'm a college graduate then you said I'm an electrical engineer you might be saying I am extremely super mega rich you might be saying I am super smart I am okay so believe in the Lord your God Believe in the Lord thy God with all your heart, mind, soul, strength. That means you're going to love yourself. You're going to love yourself enough that you're going to do positive things, productive things to help yourself and others. So love the Lord your God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. And then the second part says, love your neighbor as you love yourself. I've been putting this to practice and it works. Even when people don't necessarily like you, you got to kill them with love. You got to defeat them with love. You got to defeat them with respect. You feel me? Sometimes you got to get buck on somebody. Sometimes you got to let somebody know how you feel. But you get what I'm saying? Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Want for your neighbor what you will want for yourself. When you see somebody in a, a bad or a negative disposition, you should channel your energy to see them in a positive light. You should channel your um, power to see them in a victorious position. Want for your neighbor what you want for yourself. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. That's the golden rule. You do these three things consistently, consciously with awareness, and you're going to see your prayers answered at an accelerated rate. Dominic D. Hargrove, Slight Edge Performance Program. Let me hear from you. Shoot me an email. Peace.